Not trying to be all spooky on you, but it's a nighttime episode of Number Six with Cheese, sponsored by ICX Media. Here's a pretty dope thing that ICX Media can do. They can use their AI to create a little fingerprint of your audience, right? A little, little detailed guide of your demographics, and then they can use that information to help find you a little specific statistic to bit. Today, Junior! And they can use that information to help find you little specific marketing strategies that they know will work perfectly for your type of demographics. Isn't that interesting? It was said so calmly and confidently and well. Cause I love math and numbers and stuff. And new math. We got something cool to show you, kind of also using artificial intelligence. <laughs> Just right. kidding, it's kind of like geotagging if that word makes any sense to you. Cue whatever we came up with. Have you guys seen the Whopper detour? Wait, you don't have the Burger King Whopper here? We don't have Whoppers here. This isn't Burger King. All right, here's a little prank that old BK King had to pull on the Mickey D's. They said, guess what? If you're even thinking about McDonald's, if you're thinking about it enough to get yourself within a few hundred feet of that sucker, yeah. why don't you go on that Burger King app and for one penny and one penny only, you can get yourself a Whopper instead. I mean, I'm, I'm down for a Whopper instead. Me? That means if you're sitting in the drive-thru at McDonald's and you're thinking, man, I'm about to spend 10 bucks on whatever dumb sandwich they got when I can just get a whole <laughs> Whopper for a penny, I ain't gonna do that. They're normally between four and five dollars. Check out this top one on the BK app right here. Literally the first thing you can check into. On, baby. Mobile order only. Uh. Alright, tapping this now. Coupon unlocked. Congratulations, you unlocked the Whopper detour. You have an hour to order a Whopper sandwich for one cent. Cool. Sweet. We have an hour. You want to go do some shopping or? Order that now. Oh, we can go to it now. <laughs> So here's what I was worried about. Do you have to order more than just the Whopper? Or can you literally check out with one cent on your cart? See, See this there? right here? So you literally, your timer is right there. Oh, that's and then you click, I'm here. Order 70, all set, Sean. Cool. We're preparing your BK order now. One, one cent Whopper from Burger King by going to a McDonald's has been acquired, jump cut. Wow, one cent, we need to frame this receipt. <laughs> Can you imagine if you walked into one of your friend's houses, you're like, oh, what'd you frame up there? Ooh, a Burger King uh, it's receipt. It's a Burger King receipt. One time I got a Whopper for, for a, a penny. penny. Like, oh, okay. Like, wow, you're a How loser. How much was the frame? 4.99 from Target. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and also think about all the friends you'd lose when they found that out. You can't sit with us! Inside this BK box is a nice little happy Whopper. And if right? my memory serves oh. me correctly, we have a knife right here, which hey we do. Because we're in Chicago. I also, wonder who they uh, asked about this. It says here, America's favorite burger. I think they asked people eating in a Burger King. Yeah, it's my favorite probably, I guess. Hey, is this currently a commercial? Would you Are you say... getting paid by Screen Actors Guild wage? Scale? This is unnecessary for a second angle, but here it is, go. In case you've never seen a Whopper, which we do have an international crowd, who knows, I don't know, they maybe have not experienced the Whopper before. But it is a giant beast with a sesame seed bun. There's a whole song that goes along with it. Uh, tomatoes, pickles, onion, lettuce, um, mayo, on a, or secret sauce or something on a sesame seed bun. So I, I don't know. That's the Big Mac song. So you <laughs> you just gave McDonald's a promotion. <laughs> to all beef patty, special sauce, lettuce, cheese, pickles, onions on a sesame seed bun. To all beef patty, special sauce, lettuce, cheese, pickles, onions on a sesame seed bun. Oh, got him! <laughs> There's not much to it. There's right? a garden on this burger, by the way. I love that you're not cutting the whole thing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's just cutting it with the top off. You, if you want your tomato, you can place it back on. You sick, 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 sick freak. I got a Whopper for a penny! You can hear people now and like in a Burger King at 6 in the morning. I got one for a penny! I can't wait until I'm a grandpa and I can tell people that I... Why, when I was your age, I used to get Whoppers for a penny! Dad, that was one time for an app promotion, you dumbass! And you and you go, well look at my YouTube channel! <laughs> I haven't had a Whopper since we compared it to the Big Mac. Whopper? You got a Big Mac.
We liked the Big Mac better, so. Yeah, probably. But this one's compared to nothing else right now, so it'll probably True. win. Uh, one cent Whopper, cut in half, cheers. Cheers. Mm. I just really like BK's beef. Mm -hmm. And I'm a mayo guy. Is that what that is? I love BK's mayo too. I yeah. love their onions. Yeah, it's just a good burger. I love that Burger King did this. The low blow. We're just here to order the Whopper. Whopper? You should all be trolling each other. It's all in it's good so fun. It's so much fun. It gets more people to go to a fast food restaurant. You know, that's what you want. <laughs> <laughs> the things America should be striving towards. Should we describe it as though people haven't ever seen or had a Whopper? You've never had a Whopper. First off, the thing is, it's about the size of your face. Relative to your average burger, not compared to you know, a homemade one. Compared to your average fast food burger, this thing's kind of a beast. Secondly, like I said, those onions, bro, that mayonnaise. I do miss the fact that there's no cheese on there. I wonder if we could have got a Whopper with cheese. I don't know if that was possible. Probably not for a penny. It was 60 cents to add toppings. Mmm. So I didn't want to take it one share sure. to 61 exactly. cents. Is 60 huge, times? That's a huge increase. 60 times? But even without the cheese, I think all in all, especially for a uh, penny, this is a pretty good thing. I mean, it's not a bad burger. It's not like, like this is way, I don't know. It's hard because it's, it's kind of normal, but it's still like, I mean, it's not a, uh, just a McDouble. Um, no, it's also triple the price of a McDouble. Mm-mm. Yeah, it went. <laughs> one penny. One Damn, penny. I walked into that one. <laughs> you were like this. Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> what a cool promo. You know, like Taco Bell will do that, like, John, John Carlos Stanton hits a home run or three home runs. You'll get a free Doritos Locos taco between two and four on Tuesday. And it's like, Jesus Christ, am I going to be at Taco Bell between two and four that one day that I get a homer? No. I like that they were like, no, we're doing a whole campaign where you can get this for a We can go tomorrow and get it. Okay, so do we rate that burger? <laughs> Where's the Burger King? Four blocks to your left. Do we rate the promotion? Do we rate each other? It's actually brilliant. It's so brilliant. What it they makes did. you download the app. It makes you use it. The likelihood that you're going to delete that afterward is probably slim. That was probably their whole main goal. It's funny and it's a whopper for a penny. You got to sign up with your email address. They have, this is all just gaining email addresses. They want to be able to blast Burger King mm -hmm. in your face every couple days in an email and then you'll probably not opt out of it. You'll try to opt out, but something will go wrong, your internet will cut out and then you'll still be opt in. I think it's it's really just what marketing companies are trying to do for brands. Whoever thought of this idea is a straight up G. And I bet you they had to pitch some strong numbers for the amount of money that they were gonna lose. Right, but how much is a Whopper to make? Probably a half a penny. <laughs> so they're still... <laughs> Even, even, even whatever the real number is, I wonder what they called the value of those apps and emails. Totally. It makes it interesting. That's the things I get interested in. Marketing boner. You want to do some Patreon shout outs? Patreon shout out! Patreon shout out! Patreon shout out! What is Patreon? Well, it's a service where you can donate to creators. And we are creators, so these people are donating. It is literally the thing that keeps us afloat. Um, I, I wish I could tell you folks. I thought you were going to say, it? that is literally the thing that it is. <laughs> <laughs> just like, just like. All right, I know we both know what it yeah, is. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna say his name right. Justin Hazard. Is it Hazard? I don't know. Second Patreon shout out goes to Mr. Adam Ox with two X's. Two X's. That's a name I've seen a lot. I don't Ox. know if it's on the tweets. I don't know if it's on the YouTube comment section. If you can make a last name with an X, let alone you can add two X's into it, you've won life. You've won name. And you're represented by a beast. Thank you guys for donating. If you'd like to donate, this is the link to do so to join the not only people that get their name shot those out, are my favorite people that support us me too without a doubt me too especially because my parents are on theirs and my brother so i love them my parents don't give a sh about me imagine what this car thinks <laughs> who just pulled up backed into the spot it was like and we, we have a bright and light probably on probably pulled past and that was like whoa 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 whoa, whoa. i gotta check this what out what the is that <laughs> like this is what this car right there is seeing this a big breath uh, which I can't imagine uh, is very probably pretty disconcerting <laughs> All right, out of five, let's rate it. Let's rate the promotion. We let's know what a Whopper this. tastes like, but this could be, I don't know. Out of five, Abraham Lincoln on a copper circle. How many Abraham Lincolns on a copper circle do you give the Whopper detour here today in December 2018? Easy decision. If there's two things that get me excited in this world, it's marketing and funny jokes talking shit to people. <laughs> And that's what Burger King nailed both those. Just a brilliant, brilliant marketing plan and just kind of went at McDonald's with this. I love the truth. Bro, I died when I was on Twitter today. I saw BRB heading to McDonald's. Tweeted out for the Burger King account? Yeah. Bro, your marketing is top notch. Boss. I'm upset. I'm upset. Five. Boss. 
five. I'm gonna give it five. Abraham Lincoln's on a copper circle. A penny, and it works so well, it didn't make me order more. I already had an account with Burger King because I have a food review show. So for me, it was it was aces, dude. Aces, and it's gonna be aces for anybody who does it, because for a penny, bro, you about to eat for a penny? You're gonna feel like you went to bed with the you queen. Know, this know, is Burger King. You know who this really sucks for? Who? Homeless people. This is how it's going for them. This is oh, how it's I, going. I know where this bro, is going. Bro, Whoppers for a penny? I can finally eat today? Sorry, bitch, gotta get a smartphone. <laughs> and, a and a credit card. And a credit card. Oh, that's so You gotta have credit. Brutal, you can't pay in bro. store. Yeah. That's heartless, dog. That ain't my thoughts. I said that into the camera. That ain't my thoughts. That was me personifying Burger King going. I love that you went so close to the lights. You were like, oh, no. I pictured the actual Burger King, the actual king, getting in the face of a homeless guy going, hey, bitch, you gotta get a credit card. He would say that, but his face would be doing this. No. I don't picture, when I'm picturing, uh, when I ha when I get to use my imagination, uh, my imagination doesn't work in mascot. His lips can move in my imagination, bro. What kind of sh ass imagination you got? <laughs> I don't know, it was my idea when we were making, starting to make videos together to start a food review channel. So obviously my creativity doesn't go very far. <laughs> well, but eating food. You're like, why? Uh, people will do it. <laughs> this is their fooling America. Cause they're like, look, it looks like a Cheeto. Now you see me two. It's just now you see me three. Tom Foolery, you've been tricked. That's the reference you're going with. Burger King, do more stuff like this. Uh, <laughs> see you guys tomorrow for a brand new video. Hopefully for a brand new promotion. Probably not. Maybe I'll ask Corey for a promotion. Can I get a? Promotion? You're fired. <laughs>